boys and girls, it's Mrs. I'm here for Move It Monday. And today I'm gonna to show you some one person jump rope songs. And if you don't have a jump rope, I'm gonna show you how you can play with a ball. All right, get ready. And if you don't have a jump rope, remember you can always use a ball for these games, which is also really fun. You can do it with a partner if you have a ball, or if you have a really long jump rope like me, I'll show you how to make it shorter so you can use it by yourself. And then another day we'll get into long, uh, long jump rope games where you can play with more than one person. All right, let's get started. The first thing I'm gonna show you is if you have a really long jump rope like I do, I got this one on Amazon, I think it was $4. And it's a really long jump rope, so it's really meant for multiple people, like if you're doing double dutch. So take the handles in your hands, twist them, twist them, twist them, twist them, until it's the right length for you. All right, you're gonna start with the jump rope behind you and then push it in front of you and jump. Now, I'm not gonna show you that today because at the beginning of all of this, I broke my ankle jumping over my dog. So my ankle still really hurts when I use it too much. But um, if you have a jump rope or some kind of really long rope to make it the right size, use that trick. And then um, if you're new to jump roping, you can just lay a rope flat on the ground and just simply practice jumping over it just to get that coordination and then you'll be jump roping before you know it. So that's how to make your jump rope short enough. Now let's get to some rhymes. The first rhyme goes like this. Apple, peaches, pears, plums, tell me when your birthday comes. January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December. And what you're going to do is jump rope to the steady beat. So apples, peaches, pears, plums, tell me when your birthday comes. And then you're gonna hop out when it's your birthday. So mine's in April, so I'd hop January, February, March, April, and then I'm done. You can play this by yourself, or if you have a partner, you can play with a partner or a couple people if you know how to long jump. The next rhyme goes like this. Candy, candy in a dish. How many pieces do you wish? One, two, three, Four, and see how high you can get because obviously you want a lot of candy if you're like me. Uh, you can also play that one with your fists, um, which I know there's a game like that, but for jump rope, just count and see how high you can get before you mess up. Another rhyme you can try is my mother made a chocolate cake. How many eggs did it take? One, two, three, four. And keep going and see how high you can count. Here's another counting one. It goes like this. My little sister dressed in pink washed all the dishes in the sink. How many dishes did she break? One, two, three, four, five, six. Keep going and see how many you can get. My little sister dressed in pink, washed the dishes in the sink. How many dishes did she break? One, two, three, four, five. And I'm gonna share one more before I show you how you can play it with a ball or with a partner with a ball. And it goes like this. Down by the river, down by the sea, Mary went fishing with daddy and me. How many fish did Mary catch? And then you count and see how many fish you got. That's a really fun one. Um, you can pick any of these rhymes that you like the best and keep playing it. Um, or if you have your own, maybe your mom and dad know some jump rope rhymes that they can show you too. And then the next time I see you, I'll try to come up with some long jump games that you can play, but that takes a couple more people, but it's really fun. So again, I got mine at Amazon, but I know you can buy a rope from Home Depot and have them cut it and they'll burn the edges for you. Jump rope. Maybe you have one buried in your closet somewhere. All right, so now I'm gonna show you how to play with a ball. So if you don't have a jump rope, but you do have a ball or you just want a different way to play, you can do it this way. Uh, we'll do the first rhyme that we did, which was apples, peaches, pears, and plums. Tell me when your birthday comes. January, February, March, April. So my birthday is in April, so I stopped then, or you can keep playing. If you have a partner, then you can volley back and forth, and the person that messes up would be the loser. That's really fun. Um, you can do the break the dishes one. Um, that would be kind of fun with a ball. Um, but these are all really fun ways to get outside when it's really nice and beautiful like today. So I hope you get something out of your closet, go outside, enjoy the weather, and try some of these rhymes out um and have fun all right bye guys see you for tiktok tuesday tomorrow bye